Hello there, viewer. In this video, we are going to be doing the Divine Belial unboxing and review. This is the first Beyblade of the BU series. Beyblade vs. BU, I just said vs. Ultimate. Which, I honestly like that Belial is the first Beyblade, because think of it. It's like the ultimate Belial. Like, if Ultimate Valkyrie, it has something that every Belial has. Uh, Dangerous's core, and Dynamite's Nexus disc. So, I mean, like... It's literally Ultimate Belial, so I like how they did that for Burst Ultimate. I'm sure it wasn't intentional, but they just wanted to do Belial first. Because doing like Achilles first, Dragon first really would not make sense. Especially since there is not going to be a new Valkyrie like that or anything. I know like people have been saying that, oh, they can't wait for a new Spriggan or Longinus. Or like they're going to be super mad if they don't get a new Fafnir or Valkyrie or Spriggan or Longinus again. But it's not gonna happen, like, BU is just DB2, so why would there be, like, another DB version of those days? It just doesn't make sense. Like, these people have zero brain cells. So, yeah. Uh, that rant aside, where, um, Divine Belial is able to be used with every single gear, and there's going to be near new gears, which I was gonna show. Yeah, as you see, it's first and greatest, which I got my new greatest slayer, but it doesn't have any stickers on it. It didn't come with any. So yes, it says DB. It's DB2. And of course, burst system and stuff like that. Now in the box, oh, uh, that's just like sticker stuff. Um, Actually, there's something I want to like. So, as you can see, there's like a sticker here. That actually, they, they reused Dangerous, but they made it a tiny bit different. Dangerous never had that sticker there. So they at least did something slightly different. And now, as you see, all the old gears, now the new gears. A gear is going to be the replacement for F gear. And this, I'm hyped for. Like, okay, D gear and A gear, that's cool. A gear is just going to be like another infinite sword attachment or something. And as we all know, D gear is just going to be a sting. Like, it's probably, it's going to be best and dangerous, really, for the bound gimmick. But this is what I'm hyped up about. It's golden. I doubt that it's going to be... Like for Hyperion and Helios. I don't even think they're gonna do that honestly. This is probably gonna be an Excalibur gear because it's gold. And so at first, I thought it was gonna be a driver gear, but it looks way too big to be a driver gear. Well, I think, and I don't really think this, but I just think it'd be like really cool if they did a level chip. So, as you know, back in Chosey, we had level chips, which I do not have. And those are really expensive. I heard it was like two hundred dollars. I'm not entirely sure. Maybe more, maybe less. Take it from me. Um, this would be cool if it's like a metal attachment for Belial in its core. It's like kind of pointing to like the blade, but I feel like it's either gonna be a driver attachment to a place of gear, or it's just gonna be a attachment for the um thing right there, um, core. And you know, I'm gonna get my dynamite box just to see something. Hold on. Okay. So with my original Dynamite Belial box, so let's just compare, look, the size of the V gear and the size of the, I'm just gonna call it X gear, are the exact same when this one's like a lot smaller, so they kind of enlarge it. So this may or may not be a driver gear, I know I said it might be too big for a driver gear, but I honestly think it's just gonna be a driver gear. I mean, it would be cool if it's like an H gear, where it could have been like, an X plus Z has like one side is X, the other side is Z, like red and blue. That would honestly be really cool. Probably cooler than the X here. I mean, yeah, but yeah, all that aside, it comes with the free armor, just reuse that. Reuse Belio 2, reuse Nexus, but a new driver, Adventure. That's pretty cool. But I'm just gonna open the bay up, so. Okay, now this is Divine Belio. Oh, I dropped that. But I just wanna take a look at the layer, so. Something I've been really scared of is the core. Cause like back with Dangerous, it had this problem with some people to where the burst up would come out but would stay out. You need like pliers or something and it'd break. And with this value, I've seen videos like Beyblade Geeks where it just breaks and you have to use the pliers. And then the core is like, the burst up just breaks but it still kind of works. This looks really cool. I have like this little part here. I think Dynamite was done best. Cause like, Dynamite didn't have this little part here. Let me just take it apart. Dynamite 
they didn't have any sort of gap there because with the gap here they's like ultimate or guilty you can just smack it around really easily which i mean that's why f gear comes in hand in handy to make it a lot better and it's like an upgrade to every single belly oak think of it so dynamite if i can just put it together original dynamite all plastic in the layer then we upgraded to dangerous which is kind of like a downgrade but like it was way worse but it had rubber i mean it, it felt like plastic because like the rubber is super hard now we have dangerous I mean, now we have divine which has metal on it so that's really cool the car told me this keeps and keeps on making the belly was uh better i honestly think dynamite is the strongest one perfect dangerous is actually like pretty good but I'm gonna put all the stickers on and show you what it looks like. Also, no skip, no stickers for free armor. Okay, so now I was gonna weigh the parts, but my scale actually broke and my batteries just like straight up broke <laughs> because I like dropped it a lot. So <laughs> yeah, that broke. That happened. But I'm gonna do a little bit of a comparison. So first up, Venture and Adventure. This is the original Venture. It's like it's seafood, but Adventure is not and the venture is like a full rubber thing it's like a little bit shorter and with adventure and with adventure it's only on two parts so adventure's rubber is longer and only has two parts instead of like having a ring around the whole thing and it has a little spring that can push in when you give it v gear which honestly v gear with an all might and venture kind of made it worse for same spin but for adventure I think it's gonna be better because look, it's gonna be kind of like Hasbro's venture. So look at that. No rubber at all, so it'll have better stamina. And also, even without the V gear, the spring is just like a dash driver. Like, venture, it has like a slightly stronger spring than the original venture. Now, there's one more thing I wanna do is compare these two. You could put this sticker on this, because, like, yeah, I mean, you can still do that, but whatever. Just one more thing I want to address. This. So, you see how this is, like, mostly red? This matches a lot more than with the original. With the red, and then... This matches a lot more than the original. I think the car told me she should have just done this original core on Divine, and just do the red one for Dangerous. And there's one more thing. You see these little slots? That's for A gear. So of course, A gear is actually, I'm gonna get my infinite sword attachment. Right here. It has these little parts, which of course, you can't really do that. The A gear, it's kind of like, it's gonna be modified to where it will be able to fit, but yeah. Those little holes in it are for A gear. And one more thing, it has a star. It's one star on that. I never knew blades could have stars, but whatever. So I'm gonna put Divine Belio together to see how good of teeth it has and how it looks. I've already got all the, um, what's it called? Stickers on them. It, so, I mean, it's got the spring of a dash driver, so yeah, teeth are good. And yeah, this thing looks epic. This is the coolest looking Belio, honestly. Like, hold on, I'm just gonna compare it to all other bellies. I'm just gonna put this one together. Dangerous, my least favorite version, honestly. Divine's my favorite just on looks. Uh, Dangerous is my least favorite. I just don't like the bright red. Look at these two. D Dynamite looks cool. Dangerous looks like garbage, but Divine looks so much cooler than Dynamite. Like, seriously, this face looks amazing. So I'm gonna put all the gears on it so you can see how it looks like. All right. This is perfect. Divine value looks really cool. And something about the layer, I think Divine plus F could honestly be better than Dynamite plus F and Dangerous plus F. Dangerous plus F was not good. It only had like that good attack power because All Might plus S, that's what really like, carried it, honestly. I mean, it still had some sort of attack power of F gear, but this, um, the dynamite was not good or that good for attack. Like, even with F gear, it was mostly just used for stamina combos. Like, you never see anyone using dynamite for attack. But this, I think this is gonna be better than ultimate for attack. Not normally, but with F gear. Because normally, I've seen videos of it just getting pushed around. I think 
it's gonna be better than attack for ultimate when you give it f gear because you have metal and the soft rubber i'm like ultimate's hard rubber but yeah that's perfect danger the perfect divine belial so yeah we're gonna go to stadium and battle all right i'm at the stadium and now i'm going to do i'm gonna the amazing diamond battle stadium i'm seeing a bigger stadium come to car 20 so far but yeah I'm going to be um, test launching the thing inside of this Divine Belly now. It's a Belly again. It's Belly now. Um, and then I'll just do some test battles. I've seen that like, at first had like absolutely terrible spins. Like it's pretty bad. But I've seen it first ultimate. Like every one of my Belly has burst ultimate except for original Dino. Oh no. The sticker on Dangerous fell off. This part right here. I didn't even notice that. Right. Like, I've seen it all my belly with burst ultimate, except for original dynamite, but my perfect dynamite has burst ultimate before. So, let's do the test launch. <laughs> it's got a lot of speed, but now stamina. It's losing stamina, probably. Yeah, for those of you thinking that stamina was gonna be just like dynamites, it is not. It's stamina is terrible. Oh, I didn't even, I didn't even get the burst stop now, but I mean whatever, it's fine. So first opponent is gonna be dynamite belly. We're just gonna see if we can beat the past generation. Well, all the bays gonna be deep. Let's start doing deep. Come on, get him. Come on, divine ball. Stopper was like, it was like kind of coming out, it was like halfway out. Um, I think it's just fine. It was kind of like halfway out. It wasn't out, but like it wasn't really in. So Dynamite won. Next up is gonna be Cyclone Ragnarok. Cyclone is definitely gonna win. There's, there's no way this thing wins against Cyclone. Couldn't even beat Dynamite. I knew it was gonna be like Cyclone. As soon as I saw Cyclone like get pushed to the edge, I knew it was just over. All right, um, let's see, what's next? How about Vanish? Let's see. Okay. In none of these battles, the Burst Stopper just come out, so. Kind of weird. Yeah, off the spin is bad. Yeah, the burst stopper still didn't come out, but like, it's an off the spin battle, it doesn't really matter that much. Unless it's like doing burst, or it's funky or something. Okay, uh, next up, let's try save. Because... It lost the save. I mean, it's just save your belly, but still. I'm gonna give it another chance to save you. One click off Belial, first stopper, did not come out. Alright, um, next up, let's see. Astral Spriggan, left spin, balance mode. Come on, Divine. I can do it. Another click off Belial with no burst stopper coming out. I will switch spring into right spin later, but I completely forgot about Bahamut, so Bahamut. Bahamut defending. Uh, divine circling. Come on, let's go Divine. Oh, Roar won by a ton. Uh, I mean, 
Divine actually did like pretty good. We'll do what you see with Smacks on Roar. Alright, I'm gonna put it up against Astro again. Still in balance mode because I lost to Rubber Stick on attack mode. I was just battling the attack mode and the things fell off. Got lost and what you were this. Dangerous, but not this big. All right, guilty longness. Actually, you know what? Magma Ifrit. I know it's technically not even an EV Bay, but I still just want to use it because I want to see dangerous. I mean, not dangerous. Divine with a match. <laughs> Ifrit's just absolutely terrible. Hasbro and TT standard, just an absolutely awful, horrendous thing. Like, worse than Hasbro Banish. That's right. First off, first, do not come out. Dude, this first off. Later, buddy. Yeah, later. Trying to get the burst off her out, but it's hard. Do something, Divine. Dude, Divine just camping. Divine is scared of guilty. And Divine's gonna lose. Yeah, Divine loses. Alright. Perfect dynamite in free spin mode. Okay, I'm gonna try that again. You can do better. I'm gonna do high mode versus high mode. I know some people might actually want high mode, even though high mode, like, every bay kind of sucks. I mean, not guilty, guilty, if she has, like, no attack power in high mode. Also, yeah, the free armor has no stickers. Like, ever since Promise Valkyrie, they've just been removing the stickers on bays. I don't know why. So, if you want to <laughs> Sure, I mean, I mean, it hasn't won any opposite spin matchup. Like, I mean, it did get that draw of guilty, but if that's all. Like, all right, back to low mode, and I'll put it up against Prominence because Prominence no armor because my armor broke, and Prominence of Alfie still hasn't arrived yet. I have no idea when the thing arriving. So. Stopper still doesn't come out. Yeah, 
I think my belly was a problem with the first offer not coming out. Either that, or I'm just gonna be dead. All right, dangerous. Like watch, all my and dangerous is um shit. I mean and dangerous. Is Dangerous. Oh, Dangerous barely won. Both of them are the second click. The burst stopper saved Dangerous. And again, Divine's burst stopper didn't even activate. Divine has some sort of issue with his burst stopper. It should be like the exact same as Dangerous, but it just does not activate. I don't know why, it just has this weird problem. But, I mean, okay, I guess. Next up is Greatest Raphael, Stamina Mode. Uh, no stickers, because it didn't come with stickers. First is. First is. It's been so long since I've had the Halo. Oh, I missed it so much. Oh, hits. Big hits. Okay, and is that a draw? It was either a draw or it was greatest. Oh, it's been so long since I had that halo, but it feels, feels so weird. Self KO. Dude, Belly was lucky. Bro, self KO. You know what? That's a fine way to end off the battle. I can just do dedicated videos to this. Perfect dangerous. This is the final battle. Dangerous first divine. Come on. Come on, divine. Divine lumber. And dangerous is on the brink of bursting. Dangerous was relying on that burst stopper. Both of them clicked twice. Some contacts. You know what? I'm switching from high high mode to low high. Or high mode, whatever. It defeated Dangerous Belial. Alright. Look at this. The burst stopper still didn't come out. In the entire video, the burst stopper did not come out one time. Yeah, I think there's. I think there's an issue with the burst stopper to where like it's just way harder than the original. You might want to try to get it out like this. I don't want to break it, but I just want to see if like if I can get it out. It's kind of like I can't. Like I'm just trying to. Hold on. Yes, I got it out. Like, you need a lot of force. It's a lot harder than the original. And can I just... Okay. So, I think I'm just really weak. And you know what? I'm gonna do one more test launch. Just to see. This one, do. Nope, no, still no burst stopper. Alright, so the burst stopper is way... I mean, way harder to get out than it's dangerous. Oh, yeah, my ratings over here are like... Mm. Sam was terrible, but attack power is like fine. Sometimes it'll be really aggressive, sometimes just not. I'll give it a good. I, I, I like this Beyblade. I like the looks, I like the parts, like everything about it. I say a 7. It's better than dangerous, okay? And there's gonna be a lot more dedicated videos of this, like against dangerous, greatest, ultimate. So yeah, I hope to see that. Yeah, but.